do you? Onward! Let's all eat oranges. We should do that eating an orange. Warm it up. <laughs> hey, Alex. Did you have a baby yet, Alex? Anyway, what is up, everyone? It is I, David Franco, Hunter Freaking Pants. Freaking Wait, is this is the weekend vlog now? Yes, weekend vloggity vlog. And mom, how are you? Wait, is this the intro? Yes, it I is. Think of the date. Do you do dates? Today is January 5th, 2017. 5th, right? No, nope, 6th. Six. 6th! Six. Sorry, I, I should know that because it's the epiphany. Three kings are here. Woo. I saw them. Oh, speaking of three kings, look at my phone. First of all, how look, are you? I'm good. Look what Kareen sent me. Thank you. Oh my god, that is <laughs> creepy. <laughs> Kareem, yes. that is creepy. That is so, I did that one here. <laughs> I know, I know. That's I forgot so about cool. this. He's a big fan. <laughs> He's creeping on Hunter. He has no idea. <laughs> Hunter has no idea the big guy's behind him. Going across the bridge. The Delaware Memorial? Or the Commodore Barry? Commodore Barry. Commodore Barry. Why do we mix them up? Why? they're like eight miles from each other. And they both go towards Delaware, right? Can you see the Delaware Memorial? Is this the Delaware River? Yes. Yeah, see? see? So that's Delaware why yeah, I get confused. Over there? I don't know. Yeah, there it is. Oh. Oh, yeah, there's a bridge that's way close. over there. You can kind of see it. Anyway, Mom, what are we doing today? Going to Chester to win some money. Going back to Strasburg! Yay! God, it's only been, what, we came home Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, four days, and I'm already withdrawals. Except it's a short weekend. Boo. I know, me too. That's okay. Why'd you look at me like that? Just kidding, I'm staying oh. there this week. Ow, you get to live there, you jerk. Next Sunday I'm going back though, because I have a filling. <laughs> yes, I'm going back for a freaking filling. That seems ridiculous, but I made the appointment, I'm gonna go through with it. But then after that, I'm gonna find a new dentist. Dentist? Not until like between April and May though, right? Is that cool? Like just for a cleaning and checkup? Yeah. Maybe even June. Do you have a cleaning appointment made that we have to cancel? Yeah. Okay. That's we'll fine. just cancel when it gets closer. It's not, yeah. not until March. No big. It's not like I'm getting a root canal. I've I've had a couple root canals. They're not that bad. I haven't had any, thank God. It's a very interesting process. I got all these things coming out of your mouth. I had a crown put in. That was the it. Yeah. Although usually you get a crown. And they're done that uh, multiple times. Yeah, you usually get a root canal right. and then a crown. I done did skipped right to the crown. Really? You had to skip the he root canal. He didn't recommend a root canal. My chief, my chief, my chief. You got my lucky chief, then. My chief chipped. You seriously got lucky? There was a oh, cavity on it. I vlogged here last time because we had traffic. We were stuck under this overpass. Oh, really? I was vlogging from us. Were you sexy, actually stopped? Sexy patrons, yeah. Dang. So, is it 95 marching? I guess. I don't know. It, it was around 3.30, 4 o'clock, so That's crazy. it was near rush hour. Wasn't that going back from Christmas too? Yeah. So that was probably, yep. yeah. Christmas All traffic. traffic. All right. There you go. Intro to the weekend of Vlogity Vlog. Enjoy. Don't know what we're doing this weekend. Anything that's actually actually gonna be a pretty relaxing weekend. You wanna be in douchebag? Sorry. I'll be sorry. Well come on, you see I'm coming. Either get in the other lane which there's plenty of room or move over. I agree. Jerk face. Or slow down or speed up. You're scaring me. Sorry. Oh my god. What? Why are you always turning my music off? Uh Duh, dee, uh, monetizing the car. Or monetizing the car. Monetizing the car. Uh. Oh, oh, Dad's calling you. Gotta go, guys. So that's my doctor. Hello? Here you are. Hi, Daddy. What do you mean here I am? Did you try to call me? Thank you. Uh, 41. Yes. Okay. Yep. It's nice. Well, because, oh, David, when he gets, when he gets home, we're back in service. David, just show your car for like maybe 10 minutes. Go ahead, let it run. Yeah, I will. I'm getting off at 41, Daddy. Yo, I got this a while ago. Okay, love you, bye. It's pretty bye. good. Is this new? Cookies and cream milk? I've never seen it. I've there. never heard of it until tonight. Maybe Today. Either. Huh. Is it a chunks like of it. cookie? Now. Okay. Ew, God, why would you want chunks of cookie in your milk? Because you dip your cookie in your milk. No, I'm just so so glad you don't work at Wawa. <laughs> Could you imagine drinking and you suddenly get chunks? Talk about a turn off. Sorry. I'm an idiot, clearly. Clearly, I'm an idiot. It's pretty good, though. It's very light tasting. Where's the freaking cap? Oh, there it is. Well, you got anger issues. I, I dropped my debit card in a while while I made a scene. Yeah. No. Mom made a scene. 
I was making coffee and I heard mom scream. <laughs> Tell them. These two kids came running around the corner of an aisle as I was coming out of the bathroom and they nearly ran into me. And I screamed because they scared me. And the father's like, I'm so sorry. I'm like, no, it's okay. They just scared me. He's like, they got off their leash. <laughs> and it was just him. I know. I was telling mom, this is the, like, the perfect beginning mm -hmm. to a love story. A typical Christmas story that you see on Romantic TV. comedy or something like that. Single father, two kids, they run into a woman. He's like, oh, I'm so sorry about my children. Like, oh, back in my day, my husband had children. No. And then she falls in love with it. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Good thing I don't write movies. Right? Good thing I don't make milk for Wawa. Good thing I just vlog for a living. I pretty much do that nowadays. I just vlog for a living. These videos get a lot more views than my tech reviews do. Really? No, no, no. I'm just, I'm just saying stuff. No, it's really, it's really hit or miss. Like my LGV20 review has over 120,000 views. Nice. But then my iPhone 7 Plus unboxing probably won't pass 100,000. So it's hit or miss. But my iPhone 6S unboxing has nearly 1 million. That's I weird. Think I th no, it's just YouTube. It's hit or miss. Sometimes <laughs> you get lucky. Sometimes you don't. Panties. Be cool, David. Panties. Hunter panties. It's Hunter pants. Rah, rah, Hunter pants. Rah, rah, shish goomba. Hunter pants goomba. Rah, rah, rah. Can you tell we're just killing time? Rah, 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 rah. This video is brought to you by GMC. Fresh mushrooms daily. In that house? Yep. If you look way down there, that's runners. We're back in Strasbourg. Hey, are you gonna try to walk through the summer? To Rudders? Yeah. Behind the house? Actually, yeah, if you'll go with me. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna do that by myself. At least who knows, Ma? I could be run over by a horse. True. I'm tired, guys. I need caffeine. Oh, I see my hands. He's doing work on his house outside today in the oh, cold. He's crazy. crazy. We're back! Our wood's all gone. The tree's nice. on. And my house is still standing. Oh, my car. My car is covered. Look at that snow. I'm Very gonna, nice. Are you going to go out to eat while me and Dad go out to eat? I'll put my car over here just in case. I might go out. We'll see. I'm going to take the pickup truck. I'm going to spend the next couple hours settling in, getting stuff unpacked. I don't like things sitting around. And we are <laughs> back. Hunter, we're home. Are you excited? Hold on pants. Hold on pants. Are you excited? I'm coming, Maui. Oh, hey Maui, how are you? Come on, get inside. No, stay in. No, Maui, come on, stay inside. Good boy. Maui, come here. Come on. Oh, my little Mau Mau. I missed you. Look at him. You're my baby. You're my baby. Google Key! Alexa! Stop the music. Oh my god, you're so cute. It's so weird. Sometimes my Echo stops playing music after like two hours of inactivity. But then she played music all this week. So like 10% of the time she'll just keep playing no matter what. And then 90% of the time, like Apple Music, um, it'll auto stop playing new music because of, you know, royalties with um, the artists and everything. So, yeah, Alexa's been playing music for the last four days, maybe five-ish. Timeline's a little tough. Anyway, I am back. Let's do this. Let's settle in. Let's turn up this heat. Had it on 55. Let's get it to 65. I'm going to have to order oil soon. Hey, Maui. I see you knocked down the wrapping paper. You had plenty of food left over, plenty of water, that's always good. How's my office look? Good, beautiful. Tree is coming down probably tonight. Huh, in the bathroom? Sorry, you don't need to see poop. But the bathroom actually isn't that messy. Very nice. Hey, Mal. My little Mal Mal, he's so cool. All right, it feels awesome to be back. And look, it snowed. 
which is great. So this weekend is like the weekend of changes. My office is gonna be changed. This desk is going over here. I'm gonna get ready for some changes over there and over there and over there. So yes, it's gonna be a very exciting and productive weekend. Stay tuned. Mau Mau, it's good to see you again. I'm here all week, don't worry. Good job, David. What? How's Maui? Good. Hi, hey, Hunter. Yes, the mail's been on hold all week. Mr. Pants. Don't worry, you. Yeah. Mr. Panties, Mr. Panties. All right, Hunter, we've got lots to do. Is Maui good? A lot of things to bring in. Yes, he's Are very he excited. Good? The bathroom, surprisingly, isn't that messy. Aw, he's yeah. a good boy. Cookie. It's a cookie, Maui. He's a cookie. -key. Cookie key! <sighs> Second Yamaha speaker. No longer mono. What? Remember last week? Now we have two. Let's go. Yeah? Yo, yeah, hello, hello, hello. Dad? Yes? How was the drive? That was good. No traffic? Yeah, a lot of traffic. It got oh. worse and worse. That was a, a worse hour and long. worse. It did. On the pants. Traffic. Where's Jami? Let me show her real quick, and then I'll keep helping you. Jasmine. <gasps> Hi, baby. Oh, you thirsty? After a long drive. Good girl. <laughs> Look at her go. Yep, I got her going again. Alexa, please stop. I know, Maui. It's time to make the transition from Christmas back to our regular routine. And you know what, Maui? There's nothing wrong with that, right? Of course. Because I, for one, am very, very excited for everything I have in the works for 2017, including my setup, my projects, especially to FrancoUniversity.com. It's going to be awesome. Whoa! Did more trees go out? It did not look like that before. Oh, did more trees go out? Did did uh, more more lights go out? You know what? This might be this. Yeah. Chances are very good that this was my last Christmas with this tray. It's sad, but you know what? It's my fifth year of using it. I believe it's my fifth year. I got it when I moved into my old house in Jersey. I think it's time to retire this. It's been fun, little buddy. I mean, I'm not gonna throw it away or anything. I'm gonna keep it in the attic, just in case. I mean, hey, it's a good spare tree, right? But for now, I think it's time to move on to something better. And maybe a little classier. I'm a big, big fan of white trees, so we'll see. I'm gonna miss it. So say goodbye. It's a beautiful tree for what it is. I got it for about, what, like $100, $150, I forget. Man, that bald spot is really bothering me. That sucks. Sometimes if you flick a bulb, or just shake the tree. No. <laughs> Some people like to call me the Grinch. The Grinch sounds nothing like that. Maui, I know, I know, it's sad. All right, say goodbye. This is it. The Christmas season has come to a close. Goodbye, Christmas. I shall miss you. But we'll see you in what? 11 months? It's gonna be here before you know it. Happy holidays, everyone. Moment of silence, please. Okay. It's been fun. Time to rip it down and put it back into the box the best way I can, because let's face it, it never goes back in the box the way it's supposed to. And that's okay. Yup. Guys, I'm serious when I say this. I am so freaking excited to transform this room. It's going to look completely different than it does now. It's a much, much better use of my space. I promise the wait will be worth it. Of course, it's going to take some time, but the wait will be worth it. I do love having an attic. You can hear people outside. I actually think I like having an attic more than a basement. I like walking up the stairs to do things rather than 
going down. Is that weird? I don't know. Does that make me weird? No, just different. I've never owned an attic. I mean, my parents... I mean, okay, hold on. Back up a bit. We've had an attic in our old house. Like, old, old house in Jersey. Um, but I've never owned my own attic, so... It's just neat. It's very nice up here, too. It's nice and cool. Look at all this stuff. Boom. It's very roomy. I've seen a few people say, David, you should turn this into your bedroom. I've thought about it. I cannot. The ceiling is too low. Not a big deal, though. I've got some things in the works. And way back there, Mr. Banther, can you see that? That blue tote, I think, is yours. So next time you visit for camping or whatever, you got things ready to go. Oh, and it's really nice, watch. Coming up these steps. No, I did not skin Pikachu. This, what is that noise? Oh, there's the music, the clicking. Anyway, look, coming up the steps, it's really convenient. I can turn around and just grab stuff or whatever. And I've done that many times. I'm getting there. Check it out. The tree is down. Got a few more things to take up. Got the Windows 10 PC running again. Got my Apple Music playing. I'm good. I'm gaining space back already. And check it out. LED potion desk lamp. This is the thing I bought while I was drunk. I was gonna buy it anyway, but cool. I will set that up later, as well as my turntable. Most likely tomorrow, because I have something very special arriving from Amazon. Oh. Hey, Jazz. Good girl. Look at the snow. This is actually a great low light test for this camcorder. That looks really good. If you listen, you can hear a horse. You hear that? It's going that way. I left my light on up there. Spent the last two hours or so over here eating dinner from Rudders. We watched Shameless. Dad hates Frank. He's an asswipe. <laughs> that was a lot. What is this? It's a Mr. Oh, shut up! My one footers. Welcome to the Twilight Zone. <laughs> I love Christmas, but man, it is nice to have my decorations gone. Look, I actually have room on my windowsill again. Maui's gonna try to get out, like always. Maui, no! Stay! Oh, shite. Actually, we can shut that light off anyway. Well, oh, come on, Dave, you don't know your own light switches by now? Actually, I don't. I still get confused. I got so much done tonight. Jesus. Check it out. The tree is gone. Very nice. Boom. The eye shrine is back. Let's get this daylight bulb going. Much better, much better. Look at that. Stepping back here, you'll see that there's so much more room now. Look at that. My office looks so much bigger now. It's amazing how much room you gain back when taking down your decorations. And of course, everything else is still the same. I've got my egotistical subscriber count going. The cubes, my desk. This I might not move into this corner until Sunday night after the family lease. Well, because tomorrow is family day. I'm gonna be spending time with my family and I don't wanna be stressing like, do I have time to do this? Do I have time to do that? Sunday night's my night to edit the weekend vlog, get the other things done, get things moved. So I'm looking forward to doing that. Again, you might think that's a very odd choice to put my desk in this corner, but believe me, I've thought it through. It's gonna work out very well, hopefully. Um, but then again, maybe, maybe you're on my side with this because it's a rather awesome move. It's going to open up this corner to do some pretty cool things. I've got many, many ideas up here in this scary head of mine. But for now, this corner is back to its normal self, just stored for clothes and whatever. I'm going to do something about that soon. The eye shrine is in my office, so now I'm just going to keep my video light there. But obviously, all of this is temporary. Just picture my desk right here. It's gonna look pretty sweet. And yes, in here is pretty much still the same. This isn't gonna dramatically change until I get my TV. So hopefully that'll be by February. <clears throat> hopefully that'll be by February. There you go. Have you ever noticed you don't say the first R in February? February. Come on, say it with me, guys. February. February. 
February. <clears throat> February. February. David, shut up. GTA time. I'll see you guys in the AM. Good morning, everyone. Would you look at that? We got more snow. Nothing insane, but definitely enough to say, hey, would you look at that? Exactly. My fellow Tubies, how are you? Good morning, good morning, good morning. Let's make today a good day. I was up late. I was so tired last night, but you know what? I had so much fun in GTA. Shout out to my GTA crew. Actually, we had so many people on last night, the party was full for most of the night. We actually had to say, all right, so-and-so dropped. You can drop in now. So-and-so dropped. All right, hop in now. So, awesome times. Shout out to Joey Image. Um, you said it felt like, like a hangout, because you know our hangouts usually fill up. Um, so, I don't know, I guess, I guess last night was just a good gaming night. I had a lot of fun. I'm playing Skyrim. What? She's here to protect me. But sometimes, things can get a little awkward. Yep, I'm playing Skyrim for a bit until the parentals get back. Just want to kill some time, make some coffee. Where is my green mug? I do not know where my green mug is. It might be in the other house. I guess I'll have to wash that one. Cheers to a fun weekend. And a productive week. I couldn't help myself. I just had to get some shoveling done, so I took a break from Skyrim. Practically chugged my coffee and shoveled the snow. Now I can chill and relax. Well, since you know there's a sidewalk outside, comes down to safety and stuff like that, and I wanted to make a path in our backyard for the dogs to go through, just in case my parents have to go back there today for whatever reason. You like the shirt, by the way? It's true. Mally, please do not touch the camcorder. All right. What a rude cat. Really? Nobody wants to stare at your cheeks. Besides me. Oh my god, my glasses are so dark right now. <laughs> Holy shit, what a difference. That's incredible. And yes, I have two finer pillows. Don't judge. Uh, hi. Uh, hi. <laughs> oh my god. <gasps> now we're right your Pokeball. That's hot. Come on, what up? Wear that today. How are you? I'm here to steal a candle. Yes, you are. Let's go. Thank you. We both going up? We yeah, going please, up. if you can close the door, too. Yeah. Maui likes to come up here. Oh, my God. You should not put stuff on your steps. That's how accidents happen. I'm not going to fall. Is that really a label that says basement? That's a door. Yeah, I don't know who did that. Probably the previous tenant. All the stuff I have up here. Oh, yeah, it says basement? Yeah. I didn't even think about that. Here. Wait, what is that wood, David? I know, old, old wood. Old ass wood. You want it? <laughs> Can I walk with this? Easy, it's Sorry. still recording. Sorry. You see that? I need that wood. Huh. There's all my Christmas stuff back here. I wonder what that wood. Oh, David, look at you all organized. Heck yeah. David, have, are those hangers trash? Look, I have all this stuff in categories. That's gamer and geek stuff. Like okay. shelf stuff when I get more shelving. This is all random electronics, monitors, and Christmas stuff is back here. Wait, and you said you just saw a candle today? Yeah. Or last night. It was in a box, I know that. It was definitely in a box. I'm sorry. Probably this one. No, you're good. If you can't find it, I'll buy one. They're just like... Fine. What color is it? Yeah, perfect. Good, okay. Perfect, thank you. Is that one of the ones from Anita? Yep. Yay. Shout out to Anita, thank you again. Dad and I are going there after Home Depot, I think. I have like five extra monitors if anyone wants one. Seriously. No, I'm not gonna ship a monitor. See, they must Too have done your carpet pretty recently, David. Yep. That's remnants. Cinema display. Love this thing. All right, let's go. Cinnamon display? Cinema! Cinema! Cinnamon. Cinnamon display. You think Maui's there? Probably. Nope. His fat, his F, his FF is still in the bed. He's got the life. Still works. Yes. I thought it would die because the uh, battery. Perfect. Getting all cold. Thank you. It has a timer for anyone interested. Four hours and eight hours. Yay! Actually, 
We have a whole video about these yep. candles, remember? Yep. It was, it was around Christmas it. time, I think, two years ago? Yep. Was it last, no, two, two years ago. Two years ago. Um, I'll link it right below. Check it out. Kings. Shout out to Kings. Okay. Anita. Kings okay. Homestead? Yep. Cool. They sent us like eight candles. Is it Kings Wasn't Homestead? Wasn't it or Kings Corner? I forget. I think it's Kings Homestead. Kings I Homestead. So. Kings Homestead. It's all the same family, right? Hi, so it doesn't Maui Pie. Hey, Mal. Nice of you to join us. It's like, I got a shit. Get out of my way. <laughs> By the way, I have... Look. What really makes me mad about vacuums, I have yet to find a vacuum that doesn't suck. Ah! Do you like that? Look at that forecast. 27 with a low of 10. Damn, that is cold. It's going up to mid-40s, though. Actually, high, high 40s by Wednesday. Pretty cool. I don't care either way. I like warm and cold weather. All right. What to have for lunch? What's up, Maui? Yeah, I mean, I, I haven't had pasta sides in a while. That actually might be good. Uh, these belong in another box. Oh, this is like my candy box up here. So, whenever someone visits, I'll be like, y'all want something sweet? I got plenty of candy. That's temporary, by the way, the USPS box. Eventually, I'll get a dedicated box. Yeah, let me see here. Chicken and broccoli. Urban butter. I don't want rice. I want pasta. Why is so much freaking rice in this house? Well, I'm going to target later, so I'll probably do some food shopping. Oh, wait, I have soup. What is that? Oh, classic chicken noodle. No, I'm not in the mood for chicken noodle. I just had chicken corn chowder from Sheep. Oh my god, runners. Do not mix up them convenience stores. Oh, maybe yeah, we'll have one of these. No. All right, I'll have this. Not really in the mood for this, but I'll have this. I am going to Sheets later, so that'll probably be an early dinner. I've been in the mood for a Sheets crispy chicken sandwich for like the past several days. Hey, Mao Mao. Meow. You meow so much, hence your name, Maui. I wanted the name of Meowie. But that seems too obvious. So I said Maui, as in Maui, Hawaii. Right, Mau Mau? I know, there's many people out there probably saying, David, don't have your cat on the counter. It's not sanitary. I'm a pet lover. It doesn't really bother me all that much. Such a great theme song. Oh, it looks like Steve's in the next episode. Awesome. And it's called Fuller Thanksgiving. I'm looking forward to watching that one. Probably tomorrow. You know, as a Full House fan, like a Full House freak, I loved Full House growing up and I still love Full House. I'm not gonna sugarcoat this and say Fuller House is like the best thing to ever happen to TV. Because it's not. It's not a terrific show. I don't think it's amazing. Um, if anything, it's very cheesy, but as is Full House. But what I'm trying to say is I like Fuller House, but it doesn't top Full House. Full House is like, one of the best shows of all time. But Fuller House, it's not bad. It's not bad. And that's pretty much all Maui's been doing all day. Just kind of chilling on the chill bag. It's time for some unboxings. It's the weekend of Lockety Vlog Amiibo and an LED potion desk lamp. I love these spectacles. If you guys want to add me on Snapchat, I'll throw my little snap code right there. Come on, follow me. I appreciate it. Okay, here we go. Where are my real glasses? I cannot see crap. All right, so first of all, shout out to Danny Minnick. The Delivery will be happening soon. They tried before. Whole mix up with USPS. They apologized. It wasn't even supposed to go to York to begin with. They admitted their mistake. They tried to deliver it today. But they thought my um, hold on the mail was still in effect. So they attempted delivery, but they didn't really because my mail was on hold yesterday. But anyway, my parents went to the post office. The whole thing's cleared up. The package will be here. 
eventually. It's just going to be a little delayed. So for now, I'm going to open this. I bought this myself. Um, LED potion desk lamp. I bought it while I was drunk in last week's hangouts. Good times. Hey, I was going to buy it anyway. And these I bought a little while ago. Greninja Amiibo. Don't really care about him at all, honestly. He did something for me. But it's Amiibo, so why not? And Waluigi, another character I really just don't like. I don't find him all that interesting. But just like Greninja, why not add it to my collection? So here we go. Let's do Greninja first. Nothing overly exciting, but you know what? More Amiibo. And more Amiibo in my eyes, it's always good. And of course, you can find this at, hold on, this is going to be loud, davidstings.com. I gotta say, the design is pretty nice. Not bad. This camcorder is so good at focusing. All right, and Waluigi, which can also be found on davidstings.com. It's linked right below, check it out. Boom, right there. I think, hold on, it's gonna be a little hard to focus on this one, there you go. I'm pretty sure this is a Mario Kart edition, maybe? We got the checkered flag on the bottom. Although I don't think I've ever used Waluigi in Mario Kart. So maybe it's not, I don't know. Either way, hey, it's Amiibo. I love it. Greninja, Waluigi, very cool. Okay, now onto the more exciting part, in my opinion. <sighs> Hot chocolate. Thank you, Josh Gas. I appreciate it. LED potion desk lamp, which I thought was a ThinkGeek exclusive. But if you go on thinkgeek.com, it's no longer there. Like, I, I can't find it anymore. I don't know why. Yep, see? Zero results. Boom. In case you can't see that. Zero. It is what it is. So I found us on gamestop.com for about $45. Do not, I repeat, do not buy this on Amazon. For whatever reason, Amazon is asking for like $80 or $85 which is insane. You should pay no more than 50 bucks for this thing. Okay, I paid maybe like 52, I'm not sure, for the shipping. But still, this is gonna be worth it. I actually bought this for Danny Minnick and Alfred de Blasi for their Christmas gifts. So I figured why not buy it for myself because it looks really neat. So this is separate, which is very interesting. I guess you just put it on yourself. Little emblem of some kind. Power adapter, USB, I always love that. USB cable for power. And here comes the LED potion desk lamp. This is not the end of unboxings, by the way, for today. I have a few more things to unbox this weekend. I'm excited. I still do not have an unboxing knife. You know what, I'm gonna Target today. Maybe I'll buy myself a little knife or something, I don't know. I don't know if Target has any good unboxing knives. But I'm gonna try to open this myself without making a mess. Oh, fine, I'll get a knife, bear it back. I'm gonna make things interesting by using a pizza cutter. It should work. Yeah. Oh, nice. All right, so Danny told me this is actually pretty high quality, which is a little surprising. I love Think Geek products, but they're typically kind of cheap feeling. But wow, he wasn't kidding. The cork does come out, and that scared the shit out of me. It smells like potion. That's pretty cool. Now, unfortunately, it's not real liquid, but hey, you can't have it all. So, let's put this chain around it. Oh, wait, here we go. So, the actual light is in there. That's interesting. Kind of sits on the base. All right, so the chain, you can wrap around once. So, it lifts a little bit. There you go. That is actually really nice looking. Look at that. I'm impressed. Hmm. All right, let's get this hooked up. There you have it. That is really, really cool. You kind of just change it by, I think either tapping the base or you can pick it up. Might have like an accelerometer or something built in or some kind of proximity sensor and it changes. Eventually you'll get to the fading animation like that. That is really, really cool. Now that's not its permanent location. I don't know where I'm gonna put it yet with all the changes I have coming up in just a few weeks. So eventually that will be moved. But for now, I think it looks pretty good there. 
it fills in that empty space nicely. Also, I'm not even using the power adapter because I have outlets with built-in USB ports, which is very convenient. So when I don't want to use it, I can just unplug it. And when I want to use it, just plug it back in. Boom, it just works. And I'm feeding the cable through the bookshelf so that way you can't even see it because black on black is very nice. This I'll obviously hide right here. And I'm looking very forward to hanging these up. I'm not trying to be annoying, but I'm gonna reiterate this one more time. I am so excited about these changes. Tomorrow night, I'll start moving my desk, but the biggest changes don't begin happening until I get my new TV. As soon as I get my new TV and it's mounted, then I can start making some radical changes. It's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be really, really, really awesome. But I must remain patient. And hey, would you look at that? I now have a spare USB power adapter. Not a bad gig. Also, I just hit 141,000 subscribers. Thank you everyone for your incredible support. Okay, as predicted, the package, Mr. Minnick, just arrived. Awesome, man, this thing went on an adventure. Uh, Danny, thank you so much for your patience and for your generosity. I really appreciate this. What's in this box? Well, let's find out. This time I'll use an actual knife. You think a can opener? No, I'm just kidding. No? A portal spatula? No? Okay. A butter knife? I really need to buy a knife today. All right, here we go. I'm excited about this, dude. Thank you so much. Wait, I don't even need a knife. I can just rip the box, guys. There's no need to use a knife. This is gonna be awesome, especially with my new setup. I don't know where it's gonna go yet. I was just talking to Danny about the Slice Lane GTA. But I have options and that's always good. Here we go. Look at this. We got a great deal on this, like five or six dollars. Really, really cheap. Chromatic LED color spectrum clock. This thing is going to be amazing. I'm not gonna open the actual box right now. I'll do it later, uh, either today or tomorrow, I promise. And on the back, we have all these different patterns. Uh, pulse, RGB, rainbow, red alert. Interesting, traffic light, hmm, that could be fun. And crazy sunset. So this thing has a lot of choices. This is gonna be really, really cool to use. And plus, I love lights. Danny, I will link you right below. Guys, check him out. Danny is rolling out some awesome content lately. And I will say this, he has a special sense of style. Let's just say that, which is pretty cool. All right, he loves 80s. That's what I'm trying to say. And I have the utmost respect for that. The 80s, like, neon style 80s music and hip hop and all that stuff. I love it. All right, this I bought myself. As you probably know, I got a turntable for Christmas, as in like, you know, vinyl record turntable. I have not opened it yet because I've been waiting to get my first album. Now I paid full price for this and vinyl, much to my surprise, is not cheap if you buy brand new. I thought they were gonna be a little cheaper. But this I got for like 30 or $32. It was actually free because I got Amazon gift cards, which is very nice. Come on. So I wanted my first album to be not only brand new, but one that I'm guaranteed to enjoy. I also ordered like eight random singles on eBay. It was like a lot of eight. The seller sends out random singles. Um, I think it was like eight singles for $7, which is fine. I don't care if they're great singles or bad singles. I'm just trying to build up my vinyl collection. So if you guys have any ideas for vinyl I should buy, please comment right below because I'm looking for this to be a new major hobby of mine, especially with my new setup. I'm buying an AV rack and the turntable will go on top. That way it's easy to access and all that stuff. So here we go. I bought this and I will link it right below on Amazon. Queen, greatest hits. I'm a huge, huge Queen fan. This is the LP, I believe full album. Lots of songs to listen to. It's not like two or three songs. This is like the real deal. All right, let me open this very carefully. We have side one, side two, side three, and side four, hence two vinyls. Uh, side one has Bohemian Rhapsody, awesome. Another one by Sadust, Killer Queen, Fat Bottom Girls. Side two, Bicycle Race, great song. You're My Best Friend, Don't Stop Me Now, Save Me, side three. Crazy Little Thing Called Love, Somebody to Love, Now I'm Here, Good Old Fashioned Lover Boy. 
side four, play the game, Flash, Seven Seas of Rye. We will rock you, and finally, we are the champions. Amazing song. Terrible singer, but amazing song. Cool, I am hyped about this. I will link it right below on Amazon. Check it out and treat yourself. My peaceful valley, waiting for Wawa Mama to return. Drinking my Rudder's coffee, good as always. I did get a chicken salad um, on Kaiser Roll, my little sandwich thingy for lunch, late lunch, whatever, snack. It's pretty good. Very light, so it's not like it's filling. It was like $4.09. But it was good. And I'm very picky with chicken salad. My mom makes the best chicken salad. Oh my god, it's so freaking good. So places like Wawa, Sheets, and Rudders, I'm really picky about chicken salad. Wawa's is actually pretty good. It actually might be a little better than Rudders, but Rudders isn't bad at all. I mean, if you're really craving chicken salad, then check it out. You might like it. Do you? Just waiting for mom. She's getting something. I don't listen very well. She's getting little pieces for furniture and or knobs. I forget. Also, I found out that my AV receiver, the one I'm using now, might need some kind of preamp to work with my turntable, which kind of sucks. That means I have to spend more money, but not really because I still have Amazon gift cards to use. So I'm going to look into that today. I just want to confirm that my receiver definitely does not work with turntables by default. And if not, then it's not a big deal. Like I said, you just buy a preamp. I'm not looking to spend a lot of money, uh, but when I do buy my next receiver, I have two things that it needs to work with. 4K and Phono, meaning, you know, uh, my turntable. So I must keep those two things in mind when buying my next receiver. You know, it's kind of ironic how we go back to the past and call them trends. I mean, whether we're talking about style, like in clothing or style in furniture or especially technology, why the hell are we so into vinyl these days? Think about it, it's funny. I mean, it's, it's, it's a good thing. I mean, I had a little personal turntable years ago. It unfolded like a lunchbox. It was so cool. And I had this huge library of like children's songs and I think stories and all that stuff. And I was obsessed with it. But since then, I've never owned a turntable. So I'm really, really excited about this. Mom's coming. See ladies in there buying the whole store. Literally the whole store? And her husband's like, just let her shop. You can go ahead and just buy oh everything. God, it feels toasty in here. Really, David? What? Why is it on 80? I like it 80. What's one thing you don't like about Kristen? I love Kristen. Where is she? You don't notice a huge camera? Uh, sorry. <laughs> I know, obviously you noticed it. I didn't notice it until you said that. Oh. I thought she was on the phone. No. God, was... David, why is it so hot in I here? I know, I put it on 80. <laughs> I, like, I like warm cars. I bought more than I bargained for. I, I don't... got lights but I don't like my house too more. Oh, all right, okay, okay, okay. Question for you guys. Let's get, let's get, let's get you guys interacting and whatever. What am I trying to say here? What do you typically have your thermostat set in your house? Not in your car, but in your house. What do you typically set it to? Personally, I like it at 65 during the day. 68. You? 68, okay. Sometimes I do go 68, but never ever above that. And when I sleep, I set it to 62 because you don't you don't need it really warm. How do we get the heat out? It's hard. <laughs> I know uh, it's, it's too hot now. Uh, oh, no. It's crazy. That's why. So 65 during the day, 62 while I sleep because you don't need it too warm when you sleep. You got your body heat and your blankets and whatever. And your lovers. I was telling them about the chicken salad. It wasn't bad, right? It's very good. Yeah. Next stop, Target. Target. Did that call me? No. Come to life. And I will be using this. At Target. At Target. Oh, I should have brought our donuts, David. I got donuts in the market place. By the way, just because we went to Rudders doesn't mean we're not going to Sheets. Got it. Sheets is technically my dinner, like a very early dinner. I'm gonna get like a crispy chicken sandwich with, a, early by the time we go. with a side of fine. fries or mozzarella sticks or something. Something filling. Is yeah. that a problem? Horse and buggy. God, be careful. I love horses. I love monkeys. Me! What's the opposite of a horse? 
dog? A seahorse. Dog. The office. Tom. Tom. Me! Tom. Tom. This is how a seahorse makes. Me! Hey. Long as David. I don't look at it that way. Mom and dad already witnessed one accident today. Yes. So. Well, you didn't witness it, right? But you saw it after the fact? And it just happened because... Sad. But she was, she her was head was hanging sad. off of her body. Stop it. No, she, no, she, she, she was fine. She, it was just, she, yeah. It was like her a fender front, bender? Her car's not fine. No. Oh. Ripped off her whole front bumper. She was took it? out a 25 mile an hour sign, so she probably had to pay for that. Was it from ice? I'm sure. It was going around a curve on that historic drive. I might buy an ottoman today, Mom, if I see one. I don't know if I like that. I like that. Do you like it? I might buy an ottoman today. Is that is that weird? I don't know. I don't know if they have good ones here. I might just go on Amazon. How's that weird? But I actually have cash to spend for once. So we'll see. I say for once because I don't use cash that often. What are you hoping to buy? She's in Vegas right now. I'm oh, getting Kristen? a rug. Kristen's in Vegas for CES. Nope. No, she's not. Wait, why is she there? Lou wanted to take everybody to Vegas for a long weekend. Oh. Must be nice. Oh, I know. <laughs> Just a random trip we to Vegas invited. because. Oh, Alex. Oh, if I push. Congratulations you on your baby boy. Yes, congratulations. I was so excited so when I opened my phone and saw it. I that. know that's cool. And short labor too, man. He should have brought care. his PS4 to the hospital last night. Alex, your priorities are completely backwards. Seriously. We were hoping you'd hop on. Although surprisingly, he might be playing tonight. It's not like your wife was. I didn't think he'd be on tonight. Baby or anything. So that's three boys and one girl. Outnumbered. Yep. Aw, poor Chloe. This is one of the first things I bought for my house. I've used it like three times. It works well, just gets in the way. For the bathroom? Upstairs. Me too, I like it. I have white right now. It's got a seaside vibe, like shore colors. I have a white right now. You have a white? It white. It's a white curtain. Racist. What is all this, poles? Uh, rods? Rods. <laughs> what are you selling? What are you buying? What are you selling? Stranger. Stranger. You're so funny. These vase fillers are pretty nice. And the giraffe head's pretty cool. Isn't that a cool decoration? Just a random giraffe head sitting <laughs> You're on your so dresser? Awkward. <laughs> no, that's weird. The seashells are nice, look. The corks are nice. Oh, the green balls. Mary, she would like. I know, she would like that. I bought her something like that for Christmas, actually. She loved it. I scattered them around the room. I know. She said it was the most romantic thing anybody's ever done. I'm romantic like that. You're right. I am I. More heads. Why? What? Somebody being stupid like you would. The shoes. Their feet twisting it. Like, really? <laughs> People like to be annoying. They're walking with somebody. You think that person would be like, shut up. Stop. It's annoying. What is that? Fireside scent? Yeah, I want to smell it. Smell it, Deb. Smell it. Can't open it. Well, maybe you shouldn't open it. Yeah, you can. Smell it. You should buy it. Why would Alex oh, right here, you idiot? Attitude. Oh. Smell it, guys. <laughs> Oh, I guess so. Yo, that actually smells like that fire. Smells good. How do they do that? I have no idea. I got plenty of food. Check this out. Got stuff for tacos. Where are the taco shells? Oh, right here. Hidden under this. Look. Stuffed chicken breast cutlets, asparagus, and cheddar. $10. That sounds banging. And I'll have them across a couple nights. Same goes for the tacos. That's like dinner and lunch and maybe dinner. Got some veggies. Ground beef. That's mom's. Broccoli and cheese. Corn. Breakfast burrito, which I'm going to have for dinner one night. So maybe I will get toast, unless mom has toast. You have toast? No. Or bread, I mean. I'm sorry. That's okay. You're good. We're leaving. Next up, a 3DS XL case. Big maybe. Probably on Amazon. It is cold. I have to pee for tonight. I have to pee for tonight. <laughs> you have to pee for tonight? I have to pee or get the sheet. Transitioning back to the camcorder in three, two, one. 
I have returned home. Echo users, prepare yourselves. Alexa, stop the music. Thank you. All right, when food shopping, this is from Sheets. I got mozzarella sticks and a spicy chicken sandwich. I'm gonna heat that up soon. Make it nice and crispy in the toaster oven. I went taco shopping. I already showed you guys most of this, but let me show you again. Old fashioned vegetable beef. Jammy and jambalaya. Keep in mind, this is not a hardcore food shopping trip. I don't usually go food shopping at Target. A very large size taco sauce. They didn't have anything smaller. But that's okay, I love taco sauce. These I'm really excited about. They sound so good. And there's plenty. So that's definitely two nights. Siri's talking to me over there. Cheese. Got some veggies. Boom, boom, boom. Sour cream. Beef. Paid that small premium for 93% lean, 7% fat. Not about that fat beef, yo. Lettuce, blah, blah, blah. Oh, Junior Mints. These are for Wawa Mama. I bought those for her. And there you go. Nothing so exciting, but you know what? They're tacos. Tacos are always amazing. That's tomorrow night's dinner. All right, I'm gonna put all this stuff away. Oh, by the way, I did not find a 3DS case, as predicted. Their case selection wasn't that great. But I did get a chance to play with the new 3DS XL. I was definitely impressed. The 3D is actually face tracking now, so it's more accurate and it's not as, I don't know how to describe that. Let's just say it's not gonna make you as dizzy as the current 3DS does. And even with that said, it doesn't make me that dizzy, but I know certain people cannot play 3D games for that reason. So I will be getting the new 3DS eventually when they're actually in stock. Now that's a good looking chicken sandwich. Lighting's kind of dim right now. There you go. I'm working on getting better lighting. Eventually I want to put lights up there. Oh, hello. And lights up there, blah, 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 over here, over here. In time, guys, in time. And actually, this is the new roll they have, so I'm excited to try it. Looks banging. Now that was a great episode. Just awesome. I loved it. Thanksgiving. Now that was a great episode. I really, really enjoyed that because the whole family was together, aside from Michelle, but that definitely had the Full House vibe that I loved as a child, and I still love as an adult. And Sheets, by the way, your chicken sandwich was banging. <clears throat> Let's redo that, guys, all right? Good? All right, you can cut here. And by the way, Sheets, that chicken sandwich was banging. Good? Well, you gotta be more careful with the script, all right? And just like that, it's nearly midnight. I've been playing Skyrim for about maybe an hour, hour and a half. Very frustrating, but I finally beat a quest. Look how beautiful this game is. It's a freaking work of art. And keep in mind, it's nearly 10 years old. Yeah, chop that wood. So cool. Look at that. I could just stare at this game for hours. Imagine what a true Elder Scrolls game is going to look like on PS4 and Xbox One. And by true, I mean actually designed for these next generation consoles. I think I'm going to play GTA with the peeps for a little bit. And... You want to talk to me? I'm going to make a drink. Cream soda, I'm sorry, root beer. And Fireball. Because why not? Ugh, God, that's cold and heavy. And I suppose I'll see you guys in the morning. It's already 11.50. Good morning, everyone. Definitely slept in a little bit today. Good times in GTA last night. I gotta fix this clock. And this one, what the hell is going on with this? But yes, it is indeed Sunday, the day I say goodbye to Z Parentals. They're going back to Jersey for the week. I'm staying here. Thank God, because I, I, I have a lot of things to catch up on, including changing around my setup back there. I'm gonna hopefully work on this year's um, New Year's resolution blog post. Okay, so for example, if you go to davidfranco.com slash 2016-2016, you can read last year's blog post, and so on and so forth for previous years. 
DavidFranco.com slash 2015, 2014, 2013. Try it out. It works. I think it goes all the way back to 2012 and not further than that. But still, that's not bad. So I'm hoping to do the same thing this year for 2017 where I basically share with you guys my goals for the new year. Things that I want to accomplish. Um, from things related to my websites, my video content, my setup, my personal life, all that stuff. So I'm not going to share it right below just yet because it's not even started yet. But hopefully next weekend it'll be complete. And well, maybe I can inspire you guys. Hey, if I inspire just one person, then I've done my job. Okay, let's make today a good day. I will definitely be playing Skyrim today because I'm in a Skyrim mood. Oh my god, intense lighting. Hey, my meow. You are silhouetting hardcore. You selling iPods? I miss those iPod ads. Also, I can hear my dad's new subwoofer next door. I can actually hear the bass in my house. So obviously he got a coaxial cable working. I think he had one shipped from Amazon and USPS was delivering it today. You gotta love Sunday delivery. You see this? One of these days I'm gonna hit my head on it and it's gonna hurt. But it has yet to happen. Hi, Ma. Hi, B. I'm just sitting out of pants real quick. Hunter. I won't. Oh, crap. I just locked myself out. Hunter. Look at this nice path. Hunter. You like the snow? Here, Hunter. Hunter. How are you? God, you look so yellow in the snow. So, so yellow. Oh, look at that booty. Look at that booty. Here, ready? Ready? He <laughs> gets so hyper, I love it. Here, Hunter. Here. Ready? Sit. Sit. Ready? <laughs> Here. So cold. What are you doing? Oh, my hand is frozen now. Oh my god. You have fun out there? Once again with the dark glasses. Oh my god. I cannot imagine life without coffee. Just it would blow my mind. In a bad way. Mr. Pants finally went down in the basement, but only because I carried him down. <laughs> he didn't go down, he carried him. He's a heavy dog. Isn't he like 80 pounds? 90. 90 pounds? Hunter! Welcome to the basement. Well, the steps didn't collapse, so that's good. Dad, what are you doing? Going freaking crazy. Dad loves his basement. No. Not this week, he doesn't. <laughs> Hunter! Say you're happy. This is a great way of learning the basement. It's funny, we've been here for two months and this is his first time down here. Hi, Hunter. Oh, we've been here almost three months. Well, two and True. Two and a half. But now he'll go out by himself and hopefully learn that it's not so scary. Right on your pants? I'm step away from power tools. Hunter, come here. Hi, Vivi. He's so cute. All right, Hunter. Upstairs. Come on. Oh, David. Let's just see. Josiah gave me that echo dot, right? Yeah. Oh, guys. Okay. So, thank you very much. It really is cool. I really like it. Nice. I'm a believer of it now. I, did, I wasn't sure about it, but I really like it. I think I'm going to put mine in my living room. I don't know about my workshop area. I'd rather see it every day. But I'll call it Amazon and not Alexa, so that way they don't mix up. Get okay, answer upstairs. Just stop yeah. gave me my key. Go upstairs. Hey, go. Key kettle. Oh, well, God. He better be able to go up. Well, that's upstairs. Go upstairs. Oh, no. He's stuck down here. Okay, come on, let's go bye-bye. Oh my god. You're so weird. Go. Come on, go bye-bye. Come on, that's upstairs. Come on. Come on, that's up. Go over here. Go over walk. Come on. Go over walk. Hot get upstairs. Let's try this. Plug it in, Debbie. Come on, hot turn. Up. I'll figure it out. Oh god, he's stranded. Come on, go bye-bye. Come on, let's go bye-bye. Want a cookie? Come on, Hunter. Hunter, come on. Upstairs. You don't know a bird. It's just being silly. This should work. Okay, come on. Let's go bye-bye. Come on, upstairs. Come on. Come on, Hunter. Come on, upstairs. Go. Come on. Go. Good boy again. Come on. Oh my god. You're so weird. 
Hot star, go upstairs, go. Come on, outside. Come on. Come on, outside. Go, upstairs. Go. Up. Good boy, good. Outside. Go, upstairs. Up. Go. Good boy. He's like screwing, I'm going for it. Hunter, come on here. Hunter, come on. Go, boy. Yeah, Hunter. Hunter, let's go back down. Hunter, downstairs. Hunter, Hunter, no, no. Hunter, he's not tricks. Come on. Good. 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 boy. Wow. That was easy. Progress. Come on, upstairs. This time, no leash. Come on, baby. Upstairs. Good boy. Yay. That's not so bad, Hunter. For that. The scary world we live in. You get a treat for that. Sit and so shake. Sit, shake. High five. You're Good brave. Boy. You're so brave. Just came from Rudda's. Rudda, oh, Rudda, Rudda, chicken dinner. Ginger peach tea? Do they yep. have that there? Yep. Sheets is the one that doesn't have ginger peach, Correct. right? They gotta get on that, yo. Oh. I got a 20 what ounce coffee. What the hell? What the hell? And I got a grilled chicken club with bacon and provolone cheese and Kaiser roll. I didn't really feel like anything from the touch screen, so I just grabbed this real quick. But mom went to the touch screen. I got a shrimp taco with some spicy something sauce. Bada bing. Bada bing sauce. And chicken quesadilla. That I'm gonna have a piece of, right? Yup. Only if you don't mind. No. I didn't please. get much. I only got this. Love it. I only want two. I'm not an early eater. It's not early. It's only it's, it's one. It's one twenty-three. You idiot. But still, I don't know. It feels early to me. So yes, we're gonna enjoy lunch. Or some buggy. Or some buggy. You're right there. And then mom's piecing out. Ugh. I'm gonna For miss you. First full week of work in like three weeks. I'm sorry. Ugh, it's gonna suck. I have a lot of things to do this week too. If it makes you feel better. I need to win a lottery. A lot of moving things, a lot of uh, videos, a lot of blogging with a B. I vlogging with a V. Patrons only vlog. Win a lottery. Do I, it. I think my Sunday's there. It's actually a good shot of my house with the blue sky behind it. That's kind of cool. Look at my horse. It's like pure black now. Look at my horse. Almost pure black. It's really, really hard to get it perfect. Thank you for spray painting that. You're welcome. Uh, eventually, you eventually, Dad's gonna cover those two coaxial cables. Yeah, and get we're gonna point reroute out. them. He's got a piece of wood from up there. Where? He didn't notice a piece of wood was missing. Where? The left barn door. He oh yeah. He stopped, but he didn't Look at that. that piece huh. was missing. <clears throat> Thanks. I just wanted to see you suffer on camera. Sure. All right, show it off. Chicken Ooh. quesadilla. Oh yeah, it does have cheese on it. It huh. was excellent. That's weird. Yeah, it's kind of weird they don't ask you what kind of cheese that you want. I guess they just assume. Oh, that's and there that's me. your fish taco. Shrimp. Shrimp. Why do I keep saying fish? You have to try Sheets fish tacos. I Apparently know. they're really good. And this is my peasant lunch in a bag. You're having this. I'll get a plate. Why am I so sexy? I ask myself that question every day. Look at this natural light. Should have walked away. Their is so good. I'm hyped. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> it's like, no, I don't want half. No, I don't want it. I got a whole tub. No, salsa. Out. Take some. Okay. Not all of it. Just take some. Some sour cream. Well, I don't know how to do this. Today. You want to lift your taco and I'll put some sour cream in it? Look at that. Lift your nacho or lift your quesadilla up with some sour cream in it. Do you want sour cream? Okay. And squish it so it goes around. I'm an idiot. Okay, we gotta do four. Oh, those green peppers smell so. No, I'm, I'm good now. Okay. That's fine. What salsa? Here, I'll dump salsa. Open it. Mm. Open it. Mm. Oh, God. Your chicken's good, isn't it? So fresh. They're really good quality. All right. Everything is so fresh. Mm -hmm. Well, except for the pork the other night, I will say the pork and sour grout was very lackluster, but it was 10 o'clock at night. Mm -hmm. It's probably like the last of the batch. I will be trying it again at some point. It did look a little, a little dry like sandwich. it was the end of the batch. Mmm. Look at that quality meat. Mmm. Not bad. There you go. I'm actually going to put mayonnaise on now. Do you have mayonnaise? Alright, Hunter, this is it. This is goodbye for a few days. Hunter. You heard that, Mom? Just a few days. It's not long. 
It's a whole freaking week, David. Friday's gonna be here before you know it. I gotta work all week. You got him? Yep, let's do this. I got this dirty towel on my hand. On her pants. Good, outside. Good boy, see how he pauses? Thank you, David. You're welcome. You got that? Be careful of ice. When you come back, can you uh, pick that bottle up and just like this? Yeah. All right, Hunter, this is it. Come on. Up. Up. Good boy. I have nothing to take out of my car this time. Good boy, panties. I'm going to miss you. Be careful. Watch out for ice, Mom. I will. Gonna be this is me. Oh, it feels warm back here. As huh? always, please text me when you get back. I will. Even no, though okay. I'll be stalking you and find my friends. Okay. Or stalk my friends. Bye, Hunter. Bye, baby. Godspeed. Watch your head. <laughs> love you. Bye, Mom. Oh, be safe. I love you. If you go out, be careful. We'll see. I let the drag in the ice. Thanks, ho. My God, I'm dark. Ladies, be like this. No. All right, there you go. Another fun, successful, productive weekend with Z Familia. I'm actually gonna start editing this vlog like soon. I cannot see the microwave. My glasses are so dark. I am obsessed with heating up coffee. Am I not? All right, but yeah. I'm gonna get a head start on editing this vlog so that way I have more time tonight to move stuff around. It's gonna be fun. So shout out to my patrons. You guys will get to see plenty of behind the scenes footage of my house rearrangements and whatever. Uh, but of course, we'll be talking about it more in the weekend vlog as well. So this is just the beginning. I've been editing for the past couple hours. So far, so good. Of course, I'll be wrapping up pretty soon as I still have plenty of things to do, but I don't think it was a bad vlog. Hopefully you guys are enjoying it so far. And actually, I gotta plug in. My MacBook Pro is currently at 5% battery. That's just downright scary. You know? You know. I, I gotta get up, oh my god, I cannot wait to move this chill bag. I love it so much that, damn, does it get in the way. Look at this. <laughs> it's so stupid. Hey, yeah, that's more like it. Charging. That's always a good sign. And I guess you guys should say goodbye to this setup. At least in this room. It's pretty much going to be the same for a little bit. Just on the opposite side of this wall. And yep, I forgot to take one Christmas decoration down. I noticed last night. It happens every year. My peanuts clock. And now it's not 834. Do I have any correct clocks in this house besides my Apple Watch? My Apple Watch is always correct. Always. I just finished watching Minimalism. It's a very interesting documentary about downsizing your life. It makes you think, do you really need all of this stuff? No, but stuff makes me happy and there's nothing wrong with that. However, I'm still very interested in downsizing and that's exactly what I'm doing with my new setup eventually. Right, Mau Mau? Yeah, it's all about making the best use of your space. Anyway, I've been setting up some cameras. All right, so here's my drop cam. It's been set up for a while, but I moved it a bit. It's definitely not staying there. It just doesn't look right. But I'd rather it be here than over here because it's always getting in the way of storage and whatever I'm putting on the counter. And my Closely or Closely, I forget, Simplicam is right here. So it gets a great shots of my living room and the kitchen. God forbid anyone comes to that door, it will capture their face, including your face, Maui. I'm watching you. And I have my other camera in here, Canary, right down there. I do love my security cameras and I still have, what, one, two, maybe three more cameras to set up, but I'll do that over time. And the quality on my Nest Cam, technically a drop cam. This is before Nest acquired drop cam. My drop cam, Quality looks really good considering how old it is. It's a nice shot of my booty. There you go, it's a little better. Very nice. But wait, before I make tacos, I almost forgot to unbox this. Come on guys, chromatic LED clock. It's happening right now. Again, sponsored by Danny Minnick. 
I'm gonna use a butter knife. Why? Because I can. I'll talk about this more in future videos. But for now, I'll give you guys a quick preview. And it turns out it is on Amazon. For $15, there's only one left. So if you want it, get it right now. Treat yourself. Because apparently this thing looks amazing. And no, I will not be using it as a clock. Come on. I just want it because it's lights. I love lights. Wow. I gotta say, it actually has some nice weight to it. This does not feel cheap. Hmm. I like that. So you get the clock itself, obviously. A USB cable. And I apologize, I know my face is off frame, but I wanted to get the product in here. Hey, it's more important than my face. USB cable. Wait, two USB cables. I'll just see what that's all about. Power adapter. Right, yep, with a USB connection on the side. And another USB cable. Oh, I see, look. It's like an L-shaped adapter so you can maybe corner it. I don't know. I will have to look into that. Pull the magical piece of plastic and it should be working. Of course, I gotta plug it in. So, here we go. For now, I'm just gonna start with the black cable. I don't want to take up too much of your time. Plus, I want to make tacos. I'm hyped! Then I have a lot of things to do afterwards. I'm going to watch a movie, though, called The Girl on the Train. Sounds interesting. Didn't get the best reviews, but I'm interested. So, regular size USB. Interestingly enough, it's not micro or mini USB on the clock itself. Not a bad thing, just an interesting observation. And... Here's the power adapter. Let's plug that in first. God darn it. My drop cam power adapter is blocking it. You know what, for now, I'll unplug the lamp and plug in directly to USB. Just to show you guys how it looks. This is exactly why I'm making lots of changes to this house. It needs to be more geek friendly. Let's just put it that way. All right, it's plugged in. Here we go. First boot. Let me see. It's always 50-50 chance and it's always the wrong way. I hate that. Ooh, look at that. Wow. I don't know how well the camera is going to pick that up, but that's actually really bright. Now, how do you change the... Okay, mode. There's a mode button on the back. Oh my god. Dude, <laughs> look at that. That is amazing. Wow, oh my god, that is like blindingly bright. This is just downright amazing. This looks like a color wheel. Pretty much is a color wheel. Like, you know, Photoshop, Final Cut Pro 10, all that stuff. I think that's a bit overkill. It's a little distracting. So maybe I actually will use this as a clock and I'll put it on my wall. Because come on, look at that. That is definitely a conversation piece. Again, Danny, thank you so much. Guys, check him out, YouTube right below. Subscribe, make his day. He's a fellow content creator and he makes awesome content and well, he's a great friend. So support him, I appreciate it. Here's a nice close up. And the back, there's the mode button. You can set the time. Cool. Of course, I'm gonna mess around with this. So this is just the beginning. Damn, that looks nice. And again, it's just $15 on Amazon. Alexa, stop the music. Thank you, though, for your entertainment. I do appreciate it. The beef is done. Just waiting for the taco shells to get all crispy and toasty and warm and all that stuff. Also, what's interesting about today is the fact that it's been two years exactly, to this night, two years exactly, um, my mom and I were in Vegas having a taco bar buffet, one of the best buffets I've ever enjoyed in my life. And it wasn't even some like fancy, snooty, uh, fancy food, whatever type buffet like it was really really good the taco bar was just so damn satisfying guys just picture in your head right now unlimited tacos what's better than that awesome times awesome times and i believe that's the night we went to fremont street which was another amazing experience okay these shells are done in about 53 seconds by the way two of the shells are broken one of them i threw away but one of the broken shells um, I saved for taco salad. So there you go. When life gives you lemons, just make a taco salad.
You guys know what I mean. We're gonna start out with two hard shells, have a couple soft shells, and then probably wrap it up with a couple more hard shells and maybe one soft shell. I'm hungry tonight. Guys, cheers to a great weekend, you know, this past weekend, but cheers to an even greater week ahead. Be productive. Make 2017 your bitch. Seriously, get work done. Sorry for the profanity, but you know, it's how I like to emphasize things. Stop being lazy, get off your ass, get shit done, work on projects. But you know what? It's okay to sit on your butt. If you're sitting on your butt, get stuff done. That's what I'm trying to say. Be productive, make this a kick-ass year, make it your best one yet, and cheers to success, and I'll see you guys soon. Mmm. Mmm. This is happiness right here. My God, I love tacos.